Hi, I'm Charlie Kasov. I'm a math teacher, and today we're going to learn types of activities with triangles. So an activity that you can do with triangles is to draw a triangle, for example, like this. And we can say this is about 80, this is 20, and this looks like it's about, well, 80 plus 20 is 100, so this has to be 80 as well. Now this isn't drawn to scale, but if a student sees 80, 80, 20, then the two angles are equal, which means that two sides have to be equal. So they can, you can ask them, rather, to label it isosceles. Now another activity you can do is to list three types of triangles and have a student circle one of the three. So you can say, is it isosceles, is it scaling, or is it equilateral? Now here's another triangle. And here we can say that this is 90, and this is 30, and this is 60. So again, you can have a student uh, label it. And if they see the right angle, they should say it is a right triangle. Now, if you don't want to just draw pictures and have the students name them, you can do word games where you can say, I am a triangle with no equal angles or sides. What am I? And the student should be able to say that if it has no equal angles or no equal sides, they can say, I am scalene. So I'm Charlie Kasov, and you just learned a couple types of activities with types of triangles. You can either do fill in what the name of the triangle, or you can do a word game. So I'm Charlie Kasov. Thanks a lot.